Importing categories is a simple process. There are currently zero products on the web store and clicking on my products and on tree view will show me that my product tree is currently empty. I will be using the import categories feature found on the left side menu. I have a spreadsheet open with most of the required columns starting with the category name. This is a required field and the same applies for the category's description. The additional description is optional so as you can see, two of the categories I am creating don't have an additional description. The image column is also optional, but notice that the file name's extension is a requirement as well as the need to add the img-prefix as the system will associate your images with it. A zip file with matching image names will be required to correctly associate the images with the respective category. The pairing categories column controls where a category will be sent. If it's a top-level category, simply having the word products will suffice. Otherwise, you will break it down with the following format. This will put guitars inside musical instruments and electric guitars inside guitars. The show category on column sets what customer types this category will be available to. Zero is the default and sets it to show for both retail and wholesale. The web page file name must be unique, so pay close attention to this column. Web page title, description, and keywords are optional but it's nice to be able to optimize this information directly from the spreadsheet. Save the spreadsheet as a CSV, comma delimited file, or in Excel format, as those are the file types the store builder accepts. Go back to the Fortune 3 store builder and click on Import Categories. Browse for the spreadsheet, choose to insert, and click on Next. You will see what columns are required. Also notice that because our column names match in the spreadsheet, it automatically matched them up. Click on Import Data and a report will show you warnings regarding the images not existing. We'll take care of importing those now. Proceed to the Import Product Category Image area and browse for the zip file containing the images. Once the import is finished, the report will confirm the two images were properly imported. Now we can go back to My Products, Tree View, and see our newly imported categories listed, along with its subcategories, as we set up in the original spreadsheet. Going into the properties of the category, you will see the image was properly added to it. Click on View Live to see the categories on your website. 